I was to start lying on the Haney's, I would get so many clicks and likes and views. But because I tell the truth on everyone, I get hate. Let's talk. Straighter, yep. not yep. roundhouse right hand. And that's what we've been talking about, the straight shot. It's the one where he gets leverage on it. I don't want to kill Pull back for a, a little bit. Seconds. Nah, I want a body on my record. Now, I want to see you fight, motherfuckers. I do. All right? I'm with you. I'm with you. As long as, as, long as you're trying to fight the great, the, your, or the, the, the best competition. Welcome to the graveyard. Click the link if you dare to. Bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we're here. Welcome to the graveyard. Click the link if you dare to. Bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we're here. You wish the best fight the best. If you ain't with the moto, just click the link, bitch, and get buried like the rest. It ain't gonna work how you want it. These trolls already tried. Too many come, but don't leave. So if you hear, you gotta die. Spitting straight facts. These bitches crying cause they hate that. The LDBC's the top topic, bitch, hate that. We the best to bring the truth to these fans. So why you hate? I'm gonna laugh and keep counting these bands. Come to the graveyard. Click the link, get the hands. Bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we don't hear you. Welcome to the graveyard. Click the link if you dare to. Bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we don't hear you. Welcome to the graveyard. Nothing that I have told you guys is lies. Everything I told y'all about whether it be Tank, whether it be Shakur, whether it be whomever, even, even Frank Martin, and I believe Frank Martin is the only fighter that'll fight Devin. That's, I believe that. Everybody else is going to have all kind of weird-ass, goofy-ass stipulations. Frank Martin is the only one that I believe will dare to be great. He'll take whatever Dev offers, he'll fight Devin, and then he believes he'll knock Devin out in eight rounds. That's what he believes. I'm not, gonna, I'm not knocking that, man. That's what you believe, bro. Believe, believe what you believe, bro. We don't know what will happen until the fight happens. I got Dev. But if Frank is to be successful, so be it. He's the only one that will do it the way it's supposed to be done. I truly believe that. I don't think anybody else is willing to do that. But if I say that, why do I get hated on? The facts, the facts are the facts. Why are you got, why do you, why, why must I hate on the Haney's or someone, I see all these videos of people just shitting on the Haney's, bro, just disrespecting them. You getting 50,000, 60,000, 80,000, 90,000 views, 10,000 views, like, just disrespecting the man. But when someone's com coming out here telling the truth, it's, oh, cap, you cap, see, I know what it is, you, you guys, y'all don't want to, listen, man, you guys ran with this thing. With Giovanni Tank Davis about, oh man, Tank called Tank called Devin out. He called Devin out. What's good, man? He called Devin out. Dev, you got no, no, nah, now you gotta fight him, man. Now you gotta fight him. And then Dev says, All right, I'll drop my belts. Let's get it popping. I'll fight you at 140. Well, I mean, what do you want to do? Send me a contract. What do you want? You're the A-side. My friend, oh no, you ain't the A-side, though. Don't matter if you're undisputed. Tank the money, man. Saying all these type of things to discourage Devin from fighting the man. So Devin said, you're the A side. Oh no, you got them belts. Don't matter, man. You, we ain't paying sanction fees. We ain't paying no sanction fees, bro. If you really want it, eh, you ain't paying. We ain't y'all. Fuck all them belts, man. The belts don't matter, man. We, Devin's like, I'll drop them. Oh, Devin ain't gonna drop them. If you gonna drop the belts, drop them then. Go ahead and drop them right now. Drop them. Drop them. Drop the belts right now. But why would he drop the belts with no guarantee of a fucking fight? <laughs> Just drop him because y'all said so? To prove he wants to fight Tank Davis with no guarantee? I've told y'all this analogy before. That's like a motherfucker saying, hey, I got this big ass uh, $20 million house for you, but the only way I'm giving it to you is you got to prove to me you want it. Burn your house down right now. Don't matter if you don't got nowhere else to live. Just burn it down. Burn it down right now. Prove it. Prove you want this $20 million house. If you prove you want this $20 million house, then we can talk. Now burn your house down right now. Don't matter if your babies ain't got nowhere to live. Just burn your house down. Sounds stupid, doesn't it? Yeah, but that's what you guys wanted Devin to do. 
And when I say that, I get hate. See, look, see, I'm with you because you really don't want the fight. That's what it is. See, that proves right there you really don't want it. Nah, I show it, see? Then y'all be hating and just coming at me on a daily basis. Oh, y'all really just because you really don't want the fight. Tank, I mean, Dev can, Dev can drop his belts. Why can't Dev drop his belts? You ain't fighting no Tank at no 130, uh, or no 140. You won't fight Tank at the weight Tank wants to. If you ain't fight the weight Tank, you don't want the fight then. That's what it is. You don't want the fight. But then right after y'all tell me that Tank fights Ryan Garcia at 136 point whatever. <laughs> at 136 point whatever with the rehydration clause. Right after that. Right after telling, all right, okay, all right. Devin ain't fought in no other weight class his entire career but 135. The motherfuckers is telling me, you ain't fighting Tank at 140. <laughs> the Tank fought Mario Barras at 140. Mario Barras did not drop down. Tank fought that man at his weight class. But Dev got to, all right, all right. Okay, all right, whatever, man, whatever. The bottom line is this. When it, come to, when it came to Tank, no matter what was said, everything was always in his favor. Everything. No matter what was said. We talked about the money. Nope, nope, that's in Tank. He the money man. Whatever Tank offers. And whatever he offers, man, he the money man. How You really want to fight him or not? Whatever he offers, bro, you're going to get your highest bag. It don't really matter. You're going to get your highest bag. Don't, ma don't matter, bro. Yeah, you, you, you're the split. You might not. You're going to get whatever he takes you. But whatever he gives you, whatever he gives you is going to be your highest bag. Do you really want to fight or not? Then you don't want to fight. Then if you ain't going to take it, you don't want to fight. Oh, you're going to fight him. You're going to fight him in Baltimore. You ain't going to fight him in Baltimore. You're going to fight him in uh, motherfucking uh, 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 New York. It's going to be on the East Coast. You ain't fighting in Vegas. Why? We ain't fighting in Vegas. That's Tank Davis. You're going to fight with Tank. What Tank wants you to fight? Oh, well, you don't want to fight then. I guess you don't want to fight. Then he's the A side, right? He's the A side. You don't want to fight. Then I say, well, why can't you fight? I don't have no problem with them fighting in New York. What's wrong with MSG? Why can't you fight in Vegas? A lot of the big fights happen in Vegas. Majority of the big fights happen in Vegas. Why not fight there? Oh, see, see, look, because you want him to fight. That's his home. That's not where it's home. He's from Oakland. He lives in Vegas. He's from Oakland. Oakland is where Oakland is his home. Oh, come on. It don't matter, though. You just close to Oakland, close to Vegas. Oh, cool. then, then Vegas, then, then it's Baltimore. See, that's what see, that's why you see you guys right now, man. I see what it is, bro. You guys haters, man. Y'all just hate tank, man. See, that's what it is. Why I want tank the A side, bro? Why tank gotta give up? Why tank gotta do this? Do I tank tank and tank, man? He ain't man. Tank the A side. If you really wanna fight tank, if you really wanna fight tank, man, if you say he really wanna fight him, if you really wanna fight tank, then he gonna do what tank say then. If you really wanna fight him, then he really don't wanna fight him then. I guess you really don't wanna fight him then. Till it comes to Shakur Stevenson. <laughs> and then when it comes to Shakur Stevenson, it's like, all right, well, Dev, you the A-side, right? Oh, you, you, you guys were saying, uh, Tank's the A-side. Tank can send De Tank can send Dev a contract. Then tell me what, BF. Why can't Dev send Shakur a contract? Shakur the A-side. I mean, Dev the A-side, right? Dev the A-side. So why can't Shakur send one then? I mean, why can't Dev send one to Shakur? See, you won't got the same energy. You guys inconsistent. You say you consistent, BF, but you ain't consistent. Why can't Dev send Shakur a contract? If Dev, if, if, if Dev the A-side, that's what these niggas were saying to me. Dev the A-side to Shakur, send him a contract. Until Shakur sent him a contract. Until Dev sent him a contract. And when Dev sent Shakur a contract, then all of a sudden, come on, man. He can send him more than that. Come on, man. Give him a little bit more. Just a little bit. Oh, come on, man. Why, why, why are you giving him 25%? You mean, I mean, well, oh, he can give him that. Why can't he give him this? We just want a little bit more. I mean, damn. Listen, bro, you 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 bought all the ribs. Can we get an extra rib, though? Listen, bro, can we get some more greens on the plate? I'm just saying, you gave us, you only gave us one piece of cornbread. Can we get two? I mean, that last, I mean, damn, can we get two? I just want two pieces of cornbread, man. Can we get some chitlins? I, oh, Dev don't want to give us two pieces of cornbread, and Dev don't want to fight. He giving us one piece of cornbread? Man, we worth more than one piece of cornbread, bro. We worth more than one piece of cornbread. I can't believe nigga gave me one hog mug. Man, we worth more than one hog mug. We worth more than that. Man, we try, we, man, he tried low boss. Man, man, we good. Wow. Can you imagine if Tank sends Devin 25, 30%, 20%, and Dev says you're trying to lowball me? Can you imagine the down cry, the amount of tears and bullshit that's going to happen? Can you guys imagine that? It's going to be big. If Tank sends this man 25%, and Dev says, you're trying to lowball me, the outcry is going to be phenomenal. Tears and all kinds of shit. Not going to shit on Tank. 
I'm gonna shit on Devin. Oh, well, why, well you did to Shkordo. You gave Shkord 25%. It was crazy. Why you gave Shkord 25%? Hear what I'm saying. You shit on Dev for the offer from Bob Arum being 25%. So if Tank sends Dev 25%, you're going to shit on Dev for not accepting 25%. <laughs> you're not going to shit on Shakur for not accepting 25%. And you're not going to shit on Tank for sending 25%. You're going to shit on Dev in both ways. Why? Because it gets you clicks and views to shit on the Hades. Gets all kind of clicks and views to disrespect them, man. All kinds. All kinds, bro. You get every bit of love and desire you can get. People love you when you shit on Dev and you shit on Bill. You shit on the whole Hanies. They you love you, bro. They fucking love you. Yeah, you know boxing. You know boxing. If, you, if you're if you saying that, that that Tank knocks out Devin and Shakur knocks out Devin and Frank beats Devin and, and, and Pitbull Cruz knocks out Devin and Lomachenko really won, if you're saying that, then you know boxing. Yeah, and I can fuck with you. New subscriber here. New subscriber here because you're speaking truth. You know boxing. You're speaking the truth. But if I was to say... I do not believe Tank can beat Devin. I do not believe it. I believe Tank beats Shakur. I do not believe Tank beats Devin. I believe Shakur and Frank is close as good as fight. It can go either way. If I say that, if I say I, I believe Devin can Devin beats Shakur in a very good fight, close fight, go either way. I got Dev. If I say that, it's See, you don't know boxing, man. You don't know boxing. Uh, if I say, man, I got Dev beating Pitbull Cruz easy. I had Dev beating Lomachenko easy. Oh, man, you don't know boxing, man. You, you, you don't know boxing, man. It's just crazy. You don't know boxing. See, that's the reason why I come and control you every day. That's the reason why I make a million pages to talk to you. That's the reason why I steal your content and put it on my page and talk about your content on my page. And, and if you can't, if you don't say nothing, then I don't have no content because I need to wait for you to speak, for me to, for me to speak. But notice all the niggas that be... Dick, uh, uh, fucking shitting on, on Devin and shitting on them. You don't really see niggas stealing their content, making pages, making shit about it. You only get clicks and views for disrespecting the Hades. There's your clicks and views. There's your clicks and views. Get all kind of disrespect, all kind of hate, all kind of just, you know, just like I said, as long as you lie on them. Because everything I showed you is the truth. It is a truth that you guys said, oh, man, oh, look, uh, motherfuckers get on my page talking about, man, Devin won't look Shakur in his eyes, but he sent him a contract. Won't look him in his eyes, but send him a contract. Well, he didn't. Bob Arab did. Won't look him in his eyes. Won't do a face-off. For what fucking reason? For what reason? <laughs> For what reason? All right, if that's the case, dude. So if, uh, uh, what's the name? Edwin De Los Santos or whatever his name is or any one of them motherfuckers decided to just jump in the ring with uh, Shakur Stevenson after he fights a bird, uh, some bird nest soup nigga or some other bum ass nigga just jump in the ring with Shakur with no, no fight, just jump in the ring. And then what? Is Shakur going to fight him next? So if Frank Martin gets in the ring with Shakur, can, is Shakur going to fight him next? Is it, a, is it a foregone conclusion? Or is Frank Martin jumps in the ring and then Shakur sends him a contract and Frank says, oh man, I'm your best name on your resume, man. You can give me more money than this. Are you guys going to say, oh, but Frank ducking then. Frank don't want the smoke. Frank ducking. Shakur is the name. It ain't Frank. Shakur is the name. You didn't look good in your last fight, Frank. Shakur looked great against a fucking bum. You didn't look good against a, 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 a very good fighter. That, uh, you didn't look good, though. So you got to take what Shakur gives you. Mm. Y'all be like, yeah, that's right, BF, you right. Frank got to take Frank did not look good against that bum-ass nigga. Frank didn't look good against that bum-ass nigga. Shakur looked great against the bum-ass nigga. Frank looked like trash against the bum-ass nigga. You know what I'm saying? Since Frank looked like trash and Shakur looked good against both bum-ass niggas, then Shakur deserves more than Frank Martin. He's a two-division champion. He beat Oscar Valdez. Frank Martin ain't beat nobody. Michelle Rivera ain't shit. 
Mm. Frank Martin is the, I mean, uh, Shakur Stevenson is the WBC uh, mandatory. Shakur Stevenson is the one offering stuff. If Shakur Stevenson loses to Frank Martin, then Frank Martin becomes WBC mandatory. So for Shakur Stevenson, he's the one that's, it's a lose-lose situation for him. He ain't gaining nothing. What is he gaining by beating Frank Martin? Shakur don't gain nothing. Man, Shakur wipes Frank Martin down. Frank Martin ain't shit. Y'all wildin', bro. Frank Martin, Frank Martin ain't nobody. Frank Martin look like trash. He's some shit. Frank Martin garbage, bro. Man, Shakur beat the shit out of Frank Martin, man. Man, Shakur, Frank Martin, he don't offer nothing to no Shakur. Shakur wants the champions. Frank don't offer nothing to him. So Frank needs to take whatever Shakur offers. Until Devin makes Shakur an offer, then all of a sudden, oh, come on, man. He can give him more than that. This shit's crazy, bro. I can't believe this. He lowballing, man. Then he don't really want to fight them. That's what it is. He don't really want to fight. See, that's what it is. If, if Dev going to give him 25%, then Dev really don't want to fight. But if Shakur offers Frank Martin 25% and Frank says no to 25%, it's, well, then you don't offer nothing, Frank. So I guess you ducking just like everybody else did. You don't offer nothing. But Shakur don't offer nothing to Devin. But if Devin don't give him more, then Devin's ducking. Yeah, because everything is about Devin Haney. All of it. He's damned if he do. He's damned if he doesn't. Doesn't make a difference. He's damned if he do. Makes no difference whatsoever. Doesn't matter what he does. Y'all are going to shit on this man. It don't matter. Doesn't matter. That man can sign a fight 50-50 split with Shakur Stevenson. And then Tank said, see, you ducking me. I was about to send you a contract and then you signed to fight Shakur. That, that tells me right there you never really wanted to fight me. You never really wanted to. Now you ain't never getting a fight. You ducked me. You know I was sending you a contract. You know that. You know what con Everybody told my people, eh, well, you know, my people said that we were sending you a contract. We were sending you a contract. And then you signed to fight Shakur. That just say right there, you really don't want to fight me. That's what it is. You just want to be me. You don't want to fight me. You just want to beat me. You signed to fight Shakur. And then motherfuckers be like, he right though, BF. He right. He right. He, he, listen, bro, why he ain't wait? Why he ain't wait? See, that's what I'm saying. Why he ain't wait? Everybody knew Tank was out. Why he ain't wait? Why he ain't wait? See? Then you'll have all the same motherfuckers that shit on this man and disrespect this man and hate this man that be coming out there saying Devin Duck Tank. He's fighting Shakur Stevenson, man. What the fuck? Shakur don't offer nothing. Shakur ain't the money, man. Shakur don't offer a damn thing. This motherfucking duck and tank. Like, look at this shit. Everybody knew Tank was like, we told you a month ago that we were sending you a contract. You knew it was coming. Why are you signing to fight Shakur Stevenson? Bro? You, we told you just to wait. Everybody was saying just wait. They would shit on Devin. Crucify that man. He's damned if he does, he's damned if he doesn't. Because he's that good. So as long as we out here making shit up, lying on Devin, lying on Bill, as if Bill be, oh, Bill be capping. Yeah, capping about what? Come on, BF, you know he be lying. All right, lying about what? Come on, BF, man. He said, he said he's staying at 135 for the remainder of 2023. Did he move up? No, BF, no, but he talking about fighting uh, 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 Regis Porgrave, man. Yeah, he did say he'll fight Regis Porgrave. And he did say, I will fight this man at 140, and then I'll come back down to 135 and defend my belt. No, no, no man. No, he, 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 he just need to sit there. He just need to sit and just wait. That's what he need to do. He need to stay at 135. He don't need to do nothing. Just sit there and wait. That's what he need. The only two fights he should be fighting is Shakur and, 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 and Tank, and that's it. He just need to wait, and he need to give both of them exactly what they want because, you know, we we want the best to fight the best. You the best fight the best, ain't you, BF? That's your name, right, BF? You the best fight the best. That's all you should be wanting. It's Shakur, it's Shakur, and, and, and Tank. That's what you, all you should be wanting. You should be wanting nobody else. And you need to shit on Dev if he fight Regis. You need to shit on him. Because Regis ain't the best. Yes, the fuck he is. Yeah, he is. And he's more proven than Shakur Stevenson. Hold on to the conversation. Hold on to the conversation. But we'll get to that one too. But shitting on Devin gets your clicks and views. Telling the truth gets your hate. It is the truth that, that Shakur received the contract to fight Devin and turned it down. It is the truth that before that, five other times, that was the sixth time, five other times, Team Haney went to Bob Arum for a Shakur Stevenson fight. Five times. To include right after Devin beat Lomachenko. Five times. 
five before the contract was sent. Five times. Those are facts. But all that gets me hate. Telling the truth gets me hate. Oh, man. Listen, bro. Oh, uh, Devin, Devin, uh, Shakur always beat Devin up. He beat him up. He beat, always beat him up, man. You just watch, watch tape. Man, Shakur beat shit out of Devin, man. He beat Devin up all the time. He all, he all, all the time. Until I show you where Shakur quit. I'm tired. And then all of a sudden, it's, oh, come on, man. It's just sparring, man. Man, they was kids. They was kids. Damn, man, Shakur was, Shakur was 17 years old, man. He was 17, yeah, and that means if Shakur was 17 and Dev was 15, because Shakur is two years older than this man. <laughs> but that don't matter though, right? The age, age only matters because Shakur was young. Shakur, man, he was 17, BF. They were 17 years old. I knew it. Shakur was 17, if that's the case. Devin was 15. Yeah, if that's the case. Devin, because Devin's two years younger than this man. And if he's one year younger, then there's a time where he's two. Before before Devin's birthday, when Shakur has his, and before Devin's, they're two years. He's two years older than him. Whatever semantics. He's still older. But if I say that, I'm hating. See, uh, are you a hater, dog? See, I see you just troll. You a trolling, bro? You trolling, bro? You hate Shakur, bro? See, it's different. It's see, it's different, man. It's different. It's different when you come Shakur. Everybody, you all, all y'all say this now. Everybody saying this only because Shakur calling out Dev. That's what it is. Shakur calling out Dev. So that's the reason why y'all, y'all saying y'all coming with this energy because Shakur calling out Dev. Cap. Then when I tell you the truth, the truth don't mean nothing. The truth, when BFTB has a, has a fucking video, a morning grind, closed mouths don't get fed. Talk your shit, Shakur. Any boxer, talk your shit. But when you get an opportunity to do something now, do it. Because you're talking to get to it. To get active. You're talking to get active. So when you have an opportunity to get active, you get active or else you're fucking clout chasing. But when I say that, oh man, you a hater, bro. See, you just hate it. You just hate it. Just, no, I'm telling the truth. I'm telling the truth. The truth gets me hate. These niggas running around here lying on Dev gets them clout. It gets them clicks and views. It gets them prestige. Oh man, you know boxing. You know boxing, bro. You, you really know boxing. Because you're fucking lying. Blatantly lying. But the truth Gets me hate. Niggas won't fight me over the truth. They won't fight me because I'm telling the truth. Niggas want my head. You want me dead. You want me out of the game because I'm telling the truth. But if I was lying, you motherfuckers love me to death. Nah, I fucking be a bad motherfucker. Funny as hell, too, bro. Motherfucker funny. He funny as shit, bro. He, he be cooking. And he funny as a motherfucker, bro. I, I fucking love being a bro. But as soon as I'm telling the truth, it's a whole different story. I know why. Because lying on the Haney's gets you fucking clicks and views. And telling the truth gets you hate. But fuck it, y'all gonna hate me anyway, bro. You're gonna hate me anyway. But I'm gonna keep telling the truth. BFTB. Shout out to the mighty, mighty LDBC. And I'm out.